<laughs> oh my god. Hey Barbies, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be judging the fuck out of the 2018 Met Gala looks. Oh, yes, bitch. I'm so excited. My pussy is quivering. I just, I'm living for these looks, honestly. Like, y'all came to conquer. Some of y'all just came a mess. I, girl. If you're a new subscriber, hey Barbie, welcome to the dream house. Not really, I mean, this place is a mess. I mean, come on. If you're already Barbie, hey bitch, welcome back. I'm still Asian, so leave your shoes outside the front before you come in my house, thank you. So I'm gonna be screen recording with my phone so I can show you guys all the looks that I'll be judging. So without further ado, and I'm gonna be scrolling through Twitter today. So starting with Lisa, hey bitch, so grow up, love this see-through moment. And she looks like she can get on her knees for Jesus any day. I'm all in George Clooney, so she's cute. I just don't like the material of her dress. Kind of looks like a Chipotle burrito, but um, he's, he's too simple. Honey, I don't know why all these men just show up in suits, boring ass suits. Be creative, stick with the theme. I I don't know. Next, so B Shaffer. Love the color of the dress. That is a really cute shade of red. It's like my favorite shade of red for my lips. Love the off the shoulder moment. Um, I just don't like how at the end of the dress, it just kind of, kind of has that, the, um, I don't want to say, I want to say, actually, bitch, say it. It looks like a mermaid, but, like, not that cute mermaid, like, the overlapping scale mermaid. I mean, she's just, like, I, I'm not, I don't know. That's not that cute, though, to be honest. Olivia Munn, so you're looking like a french fry that's still in the deep fryer, but I love the headpiece. I do. And the dress, I just... It's shiny, I just don't like the color. I think it's like, it's meh, you know? Jasmine Sanders, do you guys see that dress? <sighs> what? What? Yes. Oh, she looks like she's bathing in gold. Um, love the hair too, I love what you did with it. And I love that, you can, there's another picture of her and it's like braided, she has a rosary in her braided hair. Um, living for it. Um, yeah, see, there it is. There it is. Oh, yes. Uh, you know, that's cute, you know? She came, she conquered. Next. Rita Ora, yes. Looking like the queen of darkness. I'm loving the bag. Bag really stands out, and I love the headpiece that you have. Also, I like the dress. I do. It just doesn't... I don't see how it fits with the theme. I think she's supposed to be like the angel of death or something. But I'm um, cute. Cynthia Arrivo, so first thing I notice is the eyebrows. She went off. But I don't like this whole moment that's happening here. You might as well have just filled that in with more of the fabric, but it's it's cute. I love the makeup. Makeup is better than the dress. Just saying. Bella Hadid, so I love the whole latex moment. Yes, love it. And I also like how we're not doing the train trend anymore, but I just, I like the whole, I like the aesthetic, I do. Amanda Seyfried, the hair is snatched. I love the dress, I love the material, and I love the how it just shines whenever I know she's gonna move. And I love the off the shoulder, and I do love the whole sleeve look. Loves it. Joe Cargman, so interesting lip color considering she's looking a little dead, but it does go with the ribbon moment here, um, which I do not, I do not like. It kind of looks like a, like a, like a present, and Christmas is like the leftover. Carrie Washington, so love the hair, shimmery dress. But it's one of those things where it looks like um, you like order it online and it's just like, this is gonna be so cute. And then it comes and like, you manage to work it. Mindy Calling, so she's looking a mess. The crown is oversized. Girl, I just, there's people that stay home and observe and people that actually attend the Met Gala because SZA, okay, cute. Um, not a big fan of her makeup though, but it does fit with the whole weeping Madonna look that she's trying to go for. Um, she deserves more recognition and attention. I mean, like, girl, Rihanna just walked past her like nothing, but girl, I see you. She's she's cute. I saw her on the record. Uh, okay. Ashley Graham, again with the train, but I do love the color of her dress and it does fit her nicely. Um, love her hair. Her hair is snatched, huh? Kris Jenner, honey. I don't know what you were thinking when you were putting this dress on. I mean, you you clearly thought that it was a look, but really, Rihanna. Need I say more? Zepika Paduk. 
next oh but the dress is cute do love her face in this she's just very like the whole dress is her mood honestly gabriel union so her skin is glowing yes um her dress is the perfect shade of yellow just like super complimentary and really she owns it isa gonzalez so i love the whole witchcraft vibe that i'm getting from this but she's very like magical i love a whimsical bitch yes Lewis Hamilton, yes, a crowd pleaser. It fits with the theme, which is why y'all need to take notes and fit with this theme. Just like Ariana Grande, let me just skip to her, shall I? Let me just skip. Miss Ariana Grande, so she's simple, she's cute, she's elegant, and she fits with the theme, so it's not that hard to stick with the theme. I mean, she clear, she pulled this shit off. She really did. Girl Wong, props to you, girl. Renelle Madrano. Is that all the dust that you collected by walking down the red carpet? Anne Hathaway, so the dress is a little baggy. Um, the only thing that's pulling this look together is the thorns, and even that isn't doing any justice, so. Next. Miss Katy Perry, so she could have pulled it off without the wings. Um, the wings are a bit much, like, don't you think? Um, like her career, this look is a flop. I mean, they're heavy, they're distracting, it's a bit crazy, you look in a little mess, so. Notice how my lights are popping. That's because the sun is like going down because that's how long I take to film you guys Jordan Dunn so you can even see Miss Flop in the corner. Hi, but I do love a cape plus a dress It just screams empowerment and grace Haley Baldwin and Shane Bitch, are you kidding me? Haley Baldwin and Sean Mendez, so Not much to say about her. I mean, this is kind of plain and boring. I mean like girl you put some flowers in your hair and called it a look. Oh, my bad. Ha! I just had to scroll up. Am I stupid? Yes. But Shawn Mendes. Shawn Mendes. Tracy Ellis Ross. She looks like the embodiment of diabetes. My blood sugar levels are rising just by looking at this. I just... Next. Sarah Jessica Parker. Hey, girl. You look like a walking church. There isn't much to look at except just this uh, very, very vintage European design type church Catholic. I don't know, you're getting the vibe. I, I really don't have to say anything. You just have to like look at her and just be like, yeah, that's the theme. Oh, Lana Del Rey, oh, she's so stunning. She's my favorite actually out of anyone that showed up to Met Gala. Or, or just in general, but just like I love her whole look. It's like it's everything. Love the Jesus vibes, Mary, um, Sacred Hearts. Love it. Nick Jonas, next time stay home or wear a suit that actually fits you. Jaden Smith. What is the theme here? It just looks like hype beast car crash. I don't know what the fuck it is. Um my eyes can't take it. Kendall Jenner, I can't believe you invented toilet paper. I just love how the majority who showed up to Met Gala like really stuck to the religion vibe. I mean, I don't see Beyonce anywhere, so I'm assuming that she's the Holy Ghost. Jennifer Lopez, oh, I love the broad shoulders. Love everything that's happening here. Love the cross, we have to throw a cross on there, come on. And I don't know why y'all do that on the bottom. It's just not cute. This whole mess of just it's, ah, uh, I don't know. Janelle Monet, I just love the whole, you know, have you ever seen um, American Horror Story Coven? The vibe. Nicki Minaj, she came in as the devil, honey. She just came to take all of your souls. Selena Gomez, girl, Selena, I have a lot to say about Selena. I mean, I don't, I don't hate her. Girl, she's pretty, whatever, aside. Who did her makeup? I want to talk to her makeup artist. Please. I'm gonna wrap this up with a few honorable mentions. So Solange, oh, she killed the look. She's up there along with Miss Day is clearly the winner of Met Gala for obvious reasons. Pulled the look off together so well. She's the winner. She deserves it. I'm proud of you, sis. So that's enough judgment for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And everything mentioned in this video was just honest opinion and for entertainment purposes. So Y'all can eat my app. See you, Barbies, in the next video. Bye.